Hi everybody, Adam here. Today we're taking a look at two awesome little locomotive instruction sets from Studley Trains. They offer both of these for sale and I'll include links below in case you're interested in checking them out. Now, what appealed to me in particular about these two locomotives was just how small they are while still maintaining the ability to function. Neither of them is directly powered, but if you ran a powered train behind them, they would move around your layout, which is pretty cool. And I always find it interesting to see how builders and designers are you know, fitting functional gearing systems inside really small models. And you know, I think it'll be really fun and uh, educational to build both of these models. Now, taking a look at the single truck Hessler first, really love all the details around this small model. Great stuff going on on the side of the uh, the boiler here, and you know on the front with the little light, and you know a nice cab area as well with uh, coal boxes. It looks like on the back here, really cool stuff. And I did a little bit of quick research on Wikipedia about this type of locomotive. And it looks like it was designed by Charles Hessler. And the Hessler locomotive was one of three major types of geared steam locomotives. And one of the other types of geared steam locomotives was the Climax locomotive. And this particular locomotive uh, has two steam cylinders attached to a transmission located under the center of the boiler. And this transmits power to drive shafts running to the front and rear trucks. So I assume these right here are the steam cylinders. Really cool to, uh, you know, really sort of start to dig into and understand a little more about the background of these locomotives and definitely a lot more research that I want to do to understand the history of these. I'll include links below to the Wikipedia pages that I looked at for these, uh, so you can read a little bit more about them too if you're interested. But you know, this locomotive, similar to the other one with just a few little design differences, but I think, you know, again, these, uh, these side details, the, the look of the front of the locomotive there, just a lot of great little details packed into this model. And I think that both of these are gonna look really cool uh, on sidings in our layout and, you know, periodically running around our layout. And, you know, sort of more importantly, I think they'll continue to flesh out our train collection as we try to explore locomotives, uh, throughout the history of uh, trains, as well as from, you know, different trains from around the world. So really happy about these two instruction sets. Uh, as I said, I'll include a link below so that you can check them out if you are interested. And thank you very much for watching. If you have not subscribed to the channel, please make sure to do so, so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. And we will see you again soon. Take care, bye.